camera's rolling. But that wasn't me. Rest right now and I'm not thinking about what I'm doing and I'm moving too fast or too slow and forgiving wait a minute I mean, APD was man. helping us. I don't see what the problem is. Okay, Under what authority did APD have? Sir, we don't know. We're working. I don't. Okay. They had a commissioner that passed Commi over. Yeah, like. We went from the Baptist Church over in John Young Parkway. They wanted to go on this okay. thing. Like, we don't normally ever go on this thing. Like the lead. I didn't see a pop in the lead. I they saw was, them in the rear. It was in the front, and there was a truck in the back. Yeah, the little SUV. Yeah, the, the SRO thing. Yeah. Okay. And you were following them. So who told you to take that intersection? I was going in, it was coming out, so I was just following the route, that's all. Okay, but you were stopped, though. that's one thing. Who told you to stop at that intersection? No one told me to stop, I was just going with the then route. how did you know to stop there? I was just going the route, sir. But, then why didn't people in the procession stop with you? I don't know, sir. You don't know? Why wouldn't you know? Nobody else stopped with you. You just pulled out there and stopped yourself. How much training have you had doing escorts? I had a big two-week training. Two-week training with who? People who work there. They're showing so me just people so. that work for who? I don't wish to continue. I mean, what's that? Am I getting a ticket or? I'm trying to make the determination of what I'm going to do right now. Okay, sir. I'm worried about my fiance. Here, here's the thing: what I'm doing. I'm investigating you for a crime of impersonating a law enforcement officer. Okay. That's what I'm doing. That's why okay. I read you your rights. Okay, right. or you're not your rights, but your Miranda rights. Okay. Okay? So I'm conducting an investigation. Do you want to cooperate with it or no? I wish to not ask questions. Or you don't want me to ask you any more questions? Okay. All right. Come over here. Bullshit. With okay. all due respect. Hold on, Corporal. Oh my god, he's putting videos up without my permission. Anyways. But I sent it viral to everybody. Huh? I need you to pull over. Well, this is what? APD is with us. I need you to pull over. APD is with us. I need you to pull over right now. Hey. Pull over. Ma'am, I need you to pull over. I need you to pull over for me. <laughs> County Motor 50, 10, 15.
motor 50. I'm going to need a signal 44 out here and uh, off of 50 uh, west of the turnpike westbound. I'll give you the details here in a second. I need your license. Okay. Need your driver's license. Can we pull up more? I don't feel safe right here. I'll take care of you in just a second. No, can we pull up more? I will tell you what to do. Okay. I need your driver's license. Got it. Uh, first of all, you were blocking the, the expressway. We had no authority to block the expressway. Secondly, um, when you came through, you're blowing your siren and everything through. All right? There's a driveway right down there at the entrance to the bus barn. You see where I'm talking about? Yeah. Pull in there. There is a, there is a driveway right there at the bus barn. Pull in there. We're going to be pulling into the ABC bus barn here on 50 in Gotha, or, or correction, in uh, Oakland. It's going to be on uh, two Metro State vehicles. First one is going to be Echo Papa Lima Whiskey 3-1. Second one is going to be on a black and white pickup truck. I'll give you the details. Uh, if I can have a signal 44. Do you have the insurance and registration of this vehicle? And the insurance. You're required to have it. I need the insurance and registration of this vehicle. I didn't. I, I was in the... You were in the center well, right. Just for a second. I, no, I, I followed you down the turnpike, guy. I was oh, behind I know, you. Oh, I got you. I know we you were. to move so we can move up. And I let people were going around me just fine. I wasn't stopping anybody. But you have no authority to be in that lane with your lights on. We're escorting a funeral. We state, law says, with us. state law says you must follow as closely as practical and safe. Oh, well, we are. And, right next no, to you're funeral. blocking that lane of travel. Because There's nothing in state law to, that says... We have to be able to move up and back. We can't just follow behind. That's what follow you're behind. supposed to do. But how do we move? Okay. Last car. I was doing the last one. Yep, car. stand over there. He's in the middle. He's in the middle, and I, I mean, was at the APD tail end. was helping us. I want to see what the problem is. Okay. Under what authority did APD have? Sir, we don't know. We're working. I don't Okay. Know. They had a commissioner that passed away. So we went from the Baptist Church over in John Young Parkway. They wanted to go on the okay. turnpike. We don't normally ever go on the turnpike. All right, I'll we deal, would prefer to be I'll right deal here. with you in a minute. Go ahead and stay in All your right, vehicle. You got it. Sir, I need to talk to you over here. All right, so here's the deal. I'm recording this lady. This lady. Oh, I, I'm recording too. Right, okay. So you're more than welcome to copy, get a copy of this right. recording. Yeah, I'm temple working. All right, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used as evidence in court against you. All right, you have the right to an attorney. Can't afford an attorney, one will be appointed to you by the court. Okay, listen to me. Do you understand your Miranda warning that I just gave you? I do. 
Okay, I'm going to ask you some questions about what just happened. Are you willing to talk to me at this time? Can I ask what I'm under, what I'm, like, what's going on? Huh? I'm going to ask you some questions about what just okay. happened. Well, can I have my fiance get out the car and record then? No, you can record right there. This is me. Okay. You're, you're the driver of the vehicle. Okay, you're right. Your fiance wasn't driving that vehicle. You're right, you're right. All right. Are you an employee of Metro State? I am. How long have you worked for Metro State? Uh, about two months now. For two months you've worked for Metro State? Yeah. How does Metro State pay you? Uh, I don't want to discuss that. That's okay, that's fine. Want you don't want to? Okay. So you're employed by Metro State. You've been employed two months. Okay. Uh, when I came up to that intersection, the funeral had not reached that traffic light yet. All right. There was cars in front of that funeral. I, I watched the lead vehicle and the Hertz. They hadn't. Was not in the front, sir. Okay. I, listen to what I'm saying. Just listen to what I'm saying. Okay. When they reached that traffic light, it turned red. But you were already in the middle of the intersection holding traffic. You were there long before, long before the procession even got there. Okay? So under what authority did you have to hold that traffic light long before the procession ever got there? Sir, I did not know the traffic light was. I was about the procession. I wasn't even paying attention to the light at the moment. So I just, like you see, you see me just get up there. I seen you coming over. You seen me just get up there. I just got off the middle of the procession. You didn't see me coming over. I was sitting. I seen you trying to go around the van. Sorry. Yeah, that was after I waited for the procession. I was sitting there behind the van waiting for the procession. Okay. You already had that traffic light. Right. That light turned red. Okay. Uh, I can't control that the light turned red. And but I state feel, laws. Okay, so what would happen if those cars are still coming out, I get out the way, then the other cars come and they start a wreck? Then it would still be on No, the by plate. state law, you shouldn't have entered that intersection. I didn't enter it. I was going in. You were sitting there in the middle of the intersection. I saw it with my own eyes. All right, sir, I need you to stand over there for me, please. What? Does he work for Metro State, too? He's your friend. Nope, I'm not done with you yet. Okay, well, can I check on my fiance? She's pregnant. Can I check on her? Go check, check on her. Thank you. You good? You good? Bro, see? You good? Chill out, bro. All right, come on back here. Hang tight there a minute. Hey, appreciate the back. Just hang tight for a minute. I'm gonna, I'm going to uh, write some tickets here and get some information. And uh, I'm still trying to discern whether I'm going to physically arrest him or not. Right at this point. All right.
<clears throat> We're ten four county, no new unit checks needed. Hey, Bob, how are you doing? Not too bad, how are you, Alrighty. Um, I haven't determined whether I'm going to make it, uh, this guy 1015 yet, or, okay. yet or not. Um, this is Metro State. They were doing an escort blocking the uh, Florida Turnpike. So, and then uh, he was way ahead of the procession, and he grabbed the intersection before the procession even got to the light. Which, um, so, and then no cars were going by because he's blocking it. So, um, okay. The the one the one with the phone, yeah. How long have you lived in the state of Florida? I'm back from school. I'm staying in Alabama right now in school. But you live in Florida? Yeah. You live in Florida? I'm in school in Alabama. So you go to school in Alabama? Yeah, in Alabama, yes. But you live in Florida? Yes, I mean, I'm off. Okay, I'm okay off. and you're employed here in Florida? I'm not, I just come. I mean, it's not. Well, you just said you've been employed by Metro State I for two months. I work off whenever he need help. I'm right, so you're employed? I guess you can say that. Okay, how does he pay you? Does that matter? Yes, I mean, it does matter. I get paid under the table. You get paid under the table, which I already know the answer to that. You know me. You've yeah, heard of me. You've yeah. Heard of okay. About you. Right. Yeah. Was it a problem or something? Yeah. In person? No. I'm, I'm wondering. Impersonating the police? Yeah. When you're blocking oh. traffic and okay. that's impersonating. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. Hey, can one of you, hey, back there at the light, there is a light blue, small SUV looking style vehicle. I don't know if he's still pulled over there. Down here at the traffic, when you get off the turnpike to go westbound, okay. right over there, I told him to pull over and wait for me. Okay. I don't know if he's still there. I needed to get a statement from him because they had the green light. None of them were moving because he was blocking the roadway and I needed to get a statement from him. It was. It's a small blue, like SUV type vehicle that was there. See if just see if it's still there for me. if it matters to you or not but i was at racetrack and saw the motorcycle with everybody blocking traffic with their stuff going on yeah um, yeah i'll I'm just not an expert in traffic but i, didn't, I don't know if that's true. yeah no they, they they can't the state law under 316 1974 says yeah. the funeral all vehicles comprising a funeral procession all vehicles the yeah. lead and escort must follow as closely as practical and safe through the intersection yeah, okay yeah. And they can only gain it lawfully in other words if it's red they have to stop yeah okay they can't 
go outside of the procession and go ahead, race ahead and control it and wait for the procession to come up. That's what this guy did. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah. yeah, that's exactly what he did. They had their motorcycles blocking the intersection and all that stuff. Okay, um, I'll get your name and everything and, okay. and, and put you on the witness because yeah. uh, most likely what I'm probably going to do... I thought you were part of the procession because I was at the gas pumps and I saw your car. Where, yeah. back there? Yeah, right up here. Oh, yeah. And I was like, oh, okay, I guess they do have a cop with them. No. Yeah. No, there was an Apopka officer. It was a small car, and I'm going to find out who it was. It said SRO on the side. Okay. And their claim, oh, wow, we had Popka with us. That doesn't give you the authority right. to right. act like a cop because... It doesn't look like a Popka either. Yeah, it doesn't look like a Popka. Did <laughs> you see that car? came down to 50. Well, I, yeah, since when does a jurisdiction right. outside of their jurisdiction right. has authority to give somebody else right. authority to be a right. cop? You didn't get that memo? Oh, I, didn't, I never got that memo either. I must have missed it as well. Yeah, yeah. craziest thing. So, um, so what I'm going to do, it's, it's just going to take just a little bit here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get this guy his tickets, um, confirm the insurance on the vehicle. Actually, you, you mind doing something for me? What do you need? Um, I need to look up this. Um, I, I normally, I used to have the number. Yeah, you did the but uh, this, um, it's called on Google, get me the phone number. It's E E Insurance Property and Casualty Insurance. This is the policy number, and I've got it on Google. And then I call them because I think this policy has been canceled. What is it called? Um, it is called. Um, E insurance property and casualty insurance. Get a number, let me know, and I'll, I'll shoot him a call. Yes. Okay. Yep. Uh, 800. Yep. Uh, 378. Okay. 7262. Thank you for calling insurance and all state company. We are experiencing higher than usual call volumes and appreciate your patience. If you are calling to report a claim, please use our mobile app or report your claim online at insurance.com. Customers can also you feel if I talk to you about these guys when we're done? Yeah. Um, yeah, me too. Oh, he's not there. Yeah, hey, this is Sergeant Keith Vidler with the Orange County Sheriff's Office. How are you doing? Good, how are you? All righty. Hey, just to let you know, my body-worn camera video is activated right now. I'm on a traffic stop. And the reason I'm calling you is, okay. to, is to confirm a policy number. I, can, I got the policy number I can give you.
Let, just let me know when you're ready. Yeah, go ahead with the policy number whenever you're ready. Policy for? It should be for a Jeremy DeWitt or Metro State Company. And what's the, is the policy a personal policy or is it a commercial policy? Personal. It's a personal policy? Mm-hmm. You okay. provide personal policies. Okay, you provide personal policy. Okay, the vehicles are being used as commercial use. They're with, with uh, they're escort vehicles. Um, so I'll need a, one of your investigators to call me in reference to insurance fraud because he's registering these vehicles under personal use, but he's using them for his commercial company doing vehicle escorts with lights and sirens and everything okay um if you like i can get you over to customer service and they can come help you to investigate or write a ticket for it okay all right give me a few moments and i'll get you right over okay okay he's got all of his vehicles insured under personal use not a commercial and then secondly he runs with no workers comp so anybody that gets involved in an accident, they're not even covered. How are they not out of business? Yeah, but I mean, Thanks. Thing. No, thanks. Okay, appreciate that. You're good? Yeah, because uh, I'm expecting Jeremy and everybody to come back here in just a second. Oh, uh, okay. Ask them where this escort was going. What, what cemetery? Find out what cemetery they were going to. Cemetery in Claremont. Okay. Can you do me a favor? Can you call um, the watch commander and see if we had any requests from Apopka PD to assist with a funeral? If we get, granted them mutual aid to come through our county with their lights on and everything? Uh, I'll ask the sergeant. I don't know okay. okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah.
Uh, okay, thanks. Calling the block commander. Yes, ma'am, I'm here. Okay, thank you so much for holding. So I have one of my service representatives on the phone. She's filling out a ticket for it right now. She told me to ask for your name, badge number, and work number. Okay, my name is Sergeant Keith Vidler. That's V as in Victor, I, D as in Delta, L-E-R. And my, we have EID numbers. It's 0666. And my work number is 321. Also asked me to tell, ask you, um, how did you notice about the it being an escort vehicle? Because I've been investigating this company for over a year now, and I've called before reference to how he insures his vehicles. He insures them through personal use, but they're actually it's a company, it's an escort company, which I'll send videos and any paperwork that your company needs to show that they're not being utilized as personal use. They're being used as escort vehicles with lights, sirens. Uh, they're holding traffic, running intersections, all that stuff with these vehicles. Okay. Holding traffic and running intersections. Give me one second. I'll let her know, okay? Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Actually, if she just Googles Metro State, well, she's not on there. <laughs> and she's gone. And she's gone. Oh, come on. How's motors treating you? Oh, good. We're just out at the convention center right now dealing with all that stuff. But, uh, you on your way home? Yeah, I was on my way home when all of a sudden I saw all these flashing lights in front of me. I'm like, what? And I'm looking, and I'm like, that's Metro State. They're blocking the, the, the turnpike. What they did is the funeral procession was in the right lane. The pickup truck was in the uh, center right lane. Just hold track. Everybody's bottlenecking, trying to get around them. Okay, so are you there? Yes. Okay, she said we have all the information that we need for us to fill out a ticket for the insurance fraud. Okay. Alrighty, and if they right. have any questions, feel free to call me. I appreciate it. No problem. You guys enjoy the rest of your day. Um, hang on. Okay. Hang on. Are you still there? Yes. Hang on. Let me one run. I've got two of their vehicles stopped here. Let me run this other one real quick and see what they're showing as okay. an insurance policy on this one. Hang on one second. EPL. Okay. Or I, can I give you the tag of the vehicle or a VIN number? Um, I have three vehicles, but I can tell you what they are. Uh, Dodge, uh, Dodge Charger. I have a 2004 Dodge Durango, a okay. 2008 Ford F-250, and a 2012 Tahoe, but it says Tahoe Police Special Services. Yeah, 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 he's using that, all the vehicles except the blue Dodge Durango, which is their personal vehicle, the, all, all the other ones are being used for his escort company. Okay, so not the Dodge Durango, just the Ford F-250 and the 2012 Tahoe Police. Okay, all righty. Okay, um, let and me... That's the only one he has listed here. The other one, I don't know. He has insurance with that one. Yeah, let me see what the insurance is showing up when I run it here. Um, okay. Yeah, he's not showing any insurance on file for this vehicle. So um, okay. I'll, I'll deal with that. Um, but uh, I, I appreciate your help. And if they have any questions, I'd like to say they're, they're more than welcome to call me. No problem. You enjoy your day and stay safe. Thank you. Appreciate it. Bye. You're welcome. Bye-bye. So this is a Durango? No, they have a blue Durango. Oh, okay. A personal, an actual personal vehicle. I was going to say, that, worked, that works out if this isn't, this tag's not assigned to this car. Um, tell, tell the guy there, I need proof of insurance on this vehicle here. On the, on the Dodge? Yeah, the guy in the white that's walking right now, he is the one driving it. Now, watch commander said no. Well, there was no nope. request? Nope. Can you do me one more favor? Can we call the comm center and just confirm that no other watch commander was called? He said the proof of insurance is at the office. It's not in the car. I need it. Tell them they got to get me a copy of it.
need them to bring a copy or can they send you a picture? They can send a picture if they have a picture of it. Okay. They can send a picture. He said they'll do it in court. There's no one at the office. Okay, I hate to, I'm trying to get this going at the same time. That's okay. Um, can we have the watch commander call Apopka and find out why their, their Apopka unit was doing an escort and we didn't know anything about it? Hey, um, before everybody, I think she's here to pick up. Can you do me a favor? Um, they're witnesses. They are. Yeah. Who, who, who are they? Uh, I think they, I think they know this guy. Okay. Um, yeah, they need to leave. They're, that's illegally parking. I'll write them a ticket for that. Um, get the two passengers uh, DL and everything on here or ID for me. There's two in the car? Yeah, there's a there's that guy right there that's getting out, and then there's a female in the back seat. Watch and negative on any type of police situation. Yeah. Yeah. So, rogue officer. Yep. Thanks for your help. I'm trying to, I'm trying to hurry up. I'm just gonna. What I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna get all his information. Um, I'm going to write, this guy's got fixed and release now. I'm going to get all this other guy's information. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and file the charges on him. Okay. And, and uh, I'm going to release him. Okay. All no right. worries. No, all take right. your time. We're here for you. Appreciate right. it. So was the, uh, sure. those the aunts, they thought they were involved in a car crash. Oh. I guess she's pregnant. She's having some stomach pains. You cool if she bounces the, the aunt? Yeah. Do you want us to call rescue for you? No, I want to call. Okay, you don't want a rescue to come out and check her out. Well, she can't be sitting in the middle of the lane of traffic. She's going to get rear-ended. Okay, well, call her. Yeah, she can hop in with her, but you don't want rescue to come check her out? Okay. We got her info, right? Okay. Both of their DLs, the black male and the black female. Okay, thank you. I'll get all that. Appreciate that, bud.
Do you have to have a witness to arrest for impersonating a law enforcement <clears throat> officer? No, you can be the witness yourself. Okay. But what I wanted on this case, see, what I did is I sat there and watched him. He got in the intersection long before the funeral procession ever got there. They go way ahead. They go outside the scope. Uh, the light turned actually red when the funeral procession got to the light. And um, um, he already had the intersection closed. So what I wanted to do is the far outside lane, which legally can go, they're just, the procession's in the far one lane. He's blocking them all. So I want to get a statement from them saying, yeah, I thought it was a cop car. And if I could have gotten that statement from him, I'd have 1015'd him today. But because he's, he didn't, I told him to pull over. See, I told these guys to stop, and they just kept going. And I told him to pull over, so I had to chase these guys down to get them to pull over. You know, because I... It, uh, oh, Okay. All right, thanks, mother. You put me in there. I'll, I'll put you in there. Yes, yeah, thank you. Yeah, I mean, you guys be safe. Have a All right, thank you. All right, first citation is for what I saw you doing on the expressway. Which is what? All right, you're impeding the flow of traffic. All right, you're blocking that right center lane. All right, there's four lanes up there. The funeral procession was in the far right lane. There's two, ce there's two center lanes. You were in that one just riding along the tail car, slow speed, causing a bottleneck. Everybody was having to juggle it to go around you. All right, state law under 316-1974 states, look it up. All right, all vehicles, including the escort vehicles, lead vehicles, says all vehicles of a funeral procession must follow as closely as practical and safe to each other. So the way, the easiest way to, to look at it for you is it's like a train. You have the engine of the train, you have all the cars, and you have the caboose, which is the tail vehicle. And that engine pulls the whole thing. It's conducting the escort, all right? It's facilitating that movement of that escort. When that engine comes up to a red light, it must stop. Everybody stops. Nobody's out ahead holding that light. All right? There isn't a vehicle out here holding the lane. Everybody stops. All right? If that engine comes up to a green light, you continue through. If the green light turns red while the train is going through the green light, the whole train, think of it as an engine pulling a train, is allowed to go through that red light, okay? And that's what we did back there. That's not what you were doing. I didn't have anything. I was in the rear. I know, you were blocking the one lane on expressway, okay? I was going like okay. 55, 60 miles an hour. I, mean, I know I, you were. That's what I just told you. You were creating a bottleneck back there. How did you there. get all the way up there in the front? Just asking. How did because you, you didn't front? see me go around you? No, I was looking for the uh, rear car. And I finally... I finally was able to... the toll booth? Uh, no, no, way before the toll booth. Just way be, as the, before the... I saw the procession start to exit. Uh, so I cut around you and cut... All in, the way to the intersection? All the way over to the right. All right? And past everybody. All right? Now, so anyways, for impeding the flow of traffic, black in the right center lane, the fine is $164. The second citation is for the, for the um, improper flashing lights. You cannot have your flashing lights on while you're impeding the flow of traffic. You could have your flashing lights on if you're part of the procession, but you are outside of that procession. You can't have the lights on. You have to be going just like a normal flow of traffic. All right? You can't have the lights on and block that lane. All right? That fines $114.
Second, the third one is for the horn. All right? That's a horn. You can't blow that horn. There's no reason to... That horn is a warning that somebody's pulling in front of you. You can't just blow it when you're coming through the intersection. All right? And then this one is for the... Um, for the improper insurance. Okay, this is a commercial vehicle. Yeah, okay? Mine, yeah. yeah, it's a commercial vehicle. It's for an alleged company, Metro State, an alleged company. Okay, I'm going to put that out there, an alleged company. All right. All right. He has to have commercial insurance on this vehicle. He doesn't. He has personal insurance. All right, that's misrepresentation of insurance to the state. Okay, that fine is $114. Oh, hang on, let me get to the right one here. There. Well, that one's 114. Now, all four citations payable to county court on the front within 30 days. The back of the citations are all your options that you have for these citations. Okay, and then you can go online here also. Is the obstruction a moving violation? It is a moving violation. Three points. Okay. The others are no points at all. They're just fine. Okay. All right. You're free to leave. How come these guys don't wear the uniform? I don't know why they weren't in uniform. Mr. Brown. What's your home address here? Here in Orlando? Yeah. Winter Garden? Yeah. 34761? 34787. 34787, okay. Uh, phone number? 407. Okay. Place of birth? Here. Um, Orlando? Okoye. Okoye? Yeah. Okay. Your height? Um, 511. Your weight? 265. Have you ever had a Florida license or just a uh, Alabama license? Got it in Alabama. Pardon me? Got it in Alabama. I can't hear you back there. No. You've never had a Florida license. Okay.
What was the? It was Oak. What was the cemetery? Um, Oak. Oak Hill. Hill in uh, Claremont. It's in Claremont. Yeah. Okay. Who's the funeral escort for? Uh, Xander's funeral. Xander's? Xander's in a popka? Yeah. All right. As far as going out into the intersection like you did, who told you you could do that? Following the route, that's all. You were following the route. Who I gave you the route? We were following the route. APD was leading us up. A Popka PD was following you? No, I was following them. They was lead of the escort. A Popka PD was the lead. I didn't see a Popka in the lead. I they saw was, them in the rear. They was in the front and there was a truck in the back. Yeah, the little SUV yeah, looking thing. thing yeah. Okay, and you were following them? So who told you to take that intersection? I was going in, it was coming up, so I was just following around. That's okay, all. but you were stopped though, that's what I'm saying. Who told you to stop at that intersection? No one told me to stop, I was just going around. Then the how route. did you know to stop there? I was just going around, sir. Well, then why didn't people in the procession stop with you? I don't know, sir. You don't know? Why wouldn't you know? Nobody else stopped with you. You just pulled out there and stopped yourself. How much training have you had doing escorts? I had to take a two-week training. Two-week training with who? People who work there. So, so just people that work for who? I don't wish to see. What's that? Am I getting a ticket or? I'm trying to make the determination of what I'm going to do right now. Okay, sir. I'm not worried about my family. Here, Here's the thing what I'm doing. I'm investigating you for a crime of impersonating a law enforcement officer. That's what I'm doing. That's why I read you your rights, okay? Or your not your rights, but your Miranda warning. Okay? okay? So I'm conducting an investigation. Do you want to cooperate with it or no? I wish to not ask questions. Or you don't want me to ask you any more questions? Okay. All right. Come over here. What this citation is for is for failure to produce insurance. Okay? That fine is a $114 fine. Pay by the county court on the front within 30 days. Back of citation explains all of your options. And then you can go online right there also. All right, this is what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna be writing this report up and I will be filing state charges on you for impersonating a law enforcement officer with the state of Florida. Okay. I will be filing those charges, all right. okay? And you'll get notification. All right. Alrighty? You're free to leave. Yep. You got movers. Stay on your horn. Target. Only funeral escorts of dead family members and women and children that need our help. Uh.